Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Sartak and in this video I will be talking about why I switched to Firefox as my daily web browser. So I used to be a Google Chrome user but there is one specific feature in Firefox which has made me switch to it. So let's get started. So let's quickly talk about a few cool things about Firefox. This part is a bit on the technical side but the feature I am going to talk about is for everyone who spends a lot of time on their computer for either work or studies so you can even fast forward or skip this part so let's start so Firefox is open source which means any developer can contribute in Firefox to improve it it is also not for profit and that makes it easier for at least me to trust it more uh, for my privacy like uh, than the likes of Google Chrome also Firefox in my experience is better for heavy tab users as it consumes less memory than likes of Chrome. Another thing which is uh, unique about Firefox is that it is a unique browser implementation. So what I mean by that is all the other browsers that you may have used like Google Chrome, Opera, Microsoft Edge, Brave and all, all are based on Google's open source project Chromium. And last and the most important point. Firefox has some unique features which no other browser offers and this video is about one such feature. So let's jump straight at the feature that I'm going to talk about in this video and that feature is tree style tabs. So we were talking about tree style tabs and how that can be useful for you. Uh, so people like me who spend a lot of time doing their work or studies on their laptops and a lot of that time goes uh, like using your browser and uh, we tend to open a lot of tabs and then we want a few of the tabs to stay there so that we can go back to them on something that we were doing previously and you can see like when we have a lot of tabs it's, it becomes very difficult for you to read even the title of the tab and uh, then organizing these tabs is a very tedious task so right now I have a Google Chrome opened with some set of tabs and uh, you can see there is my gmail there is amazon i'm searching for a laptop and then there are a few pages that i've opened from that i another i had did a google search to install oh my z shell on my mac i have a few related articles also open for that i did another google search to learn how to invest in stock market and then i have a few tabs open for that as well I have my WhatsApp web open which isn't connected right now and I have another Google search tab. So you can see I have a lot of tabs open here. So this is Google Chrome and I have the same set of tabs open in Firefox as well. And now right now you can see that it looks the same right. It is very difficult in Firefox as well to read what is written on the, written on the tabs and going back to a tab is also very tedious. Organizing them is also very tedious. So. Uh, let's let me just quickly show you what can help here so how is tree style tab helping here so right now I have tree style tab installed on my Firefox and I'll quickly just click a button and the magic of it you'll see so this is what I want to show you so tree style tab what it does is, is organizes your tabs in a tree like fashion so mostly when you have some tabs open uh, a lot of these tabs are related so it's not like you have 100 tabs open that will completely not related for example I had my gmail opened I had amazon opened and after that search I opened two amazon pages also I was searching how to install a particular shell on my mac and I had few articles related to that open then I was also searching about how to invest in stock market learning to invest in stock market I had a few tabs related to that open as well I had whatsapp web open and I did another google search so here you can see how tree style tab was able to show you the titles and it was also able to organize your tabs in a better way you can even collapse your tabs and then it's much easier to see what each tab uh, has and the, the good thing about tree style tabs is it uses the space you have so you, the screens are very wide right now and uh, there is a lot of space that you can use on the screen that can help you see uh, the title of the tabs and organize the tabs in a better manner so that's about tree style tab 
so we can quickly uh, go on how you can install tree style tabs so that's really simple you search tree style tab firefox you can then open uh, the first link itself and you can see because i opened a link in the new tab from this tab it has become the child tab and uh, you can see here freestyle tab is an extension of firefox which you can easily like add to your browser i already have it added so as i said previously google chrome does not offer this feature the reason being firefox is a unique implementation and it gives the feature of a sidebar to be added which chrome or any other browser does not offer you you can again have a look at the uh, tree style tab panel you have all the apps organized all the tabs organized sorry and uh, there is another feature uh, which i would like to show you there are a lot of features you can explore yourselves but there is one feature which is very handy now you can also pin tabs for example the tabs which are very important to you which you would like to go back to you can uh, like pin the tabs and you can go back to them just by a single click like after you have a lot of tabs open even the tree style tab view can like be very populated and it will be easier for you to jump right back to those tabs for example to jump back to uh, web whatsapp web you can just click here and you'll be there for and for gmail again you can do the same so that is all about uh, tree style tabs from my side uh, just a quick recap tree style tabs like it really helps you organize your tabs uh, you can organize the similar tabs in a tree like manner and uh, you can just go back to any tab you want after that and uh, you can even pin tabs so it has been very really helpful for me to increase my productivity as i can keep as many tabs i want open and i can go back to them very easily and uh, so i would definitely say you should give it a try and see if it helps you uh, if you like this video you can give it a thumbs up and since i'm new to making youtube videos uh, i would really welcome any uh, suggestions and uh, if you dislike the video due to any reason you can mention that in the comment and i would like to take that feedback and improve the future videos that i make so thanks everyone have a good day